don't actually know what a Fabio Romano Super Smash Brothers gauntlet match actually is. I mean, I can assume. There he is, Mr. 24 Carat himself, Fabio Romano. As I was saying, we don't know what a, what a Fabio Romano Super Smash Brothers gauntlet match is, but we're about to find out as his namesake is currently on his way to the ring. And uh, Dal Jones has now joined me on commentary. Hello. Uh, yes, yeah, so a Fabio Romano Super Smash Brothers gauntlet match. Um, I'm assuming you know nothing. Well, I think what's happened here is that Fabio had a phenomenal match yesterday with our champion Alexander Indeed Rock. he did. And I feel like Fabio has had a word with the UKPW management. And from what I can gather, being a broadcast journalist, is that Fabio wants to prove to UKPW management that he deserves that title shot. So I think what he's doing, I think what this is, especially that we're here at the Rapture Gaming Festival, I think it's a gauntlet match, I think is what he's going to be doing. I think he's challenging the UKPW locker room to some, some matches. I'm throwing the gaming uh, related name to it. Ladies oh, here we and go. gentlemen, especially ladies, my name is Mr. 24 Cards, Fabio Romano. Seeing that it might have been um, visually impaired at that moment, but I decided to uh, this little challenge here the Super Smash Bros. Invitational Counter Match. The first ever. Very true. I would like to say, please, the first of all, please come down. Wow, interesting. Very interesting, and look who's donning the stripes as well. That's right. KM Lane, Medway Zone. Oh. Be in action later on. Right, okay, I have no idea who this guy is, and he has some. What was that? 24 pizzas? I think it was 75 pizzas. 75 pizzas? Who is this guy? What's his name? I didn't catch any of that. <laughs> well, going to be an impressive I'm going, debut. I'm going to ask our ring announcer, Dave O'Connor. Mr. O'Connor. Oh, can't even get the staff. Well... This is awkward. There we go. Well, KM Lane knows how to referee. I mean, who is this guy? Mr. O'Connor, if you could please indulge your commentary team at the commentary uh, commentation station. Who is this guy? Why is it no one will speak to me when you're sitting next to me? Oh, they're too, too da I'm too dangerous, that's what it is. Well, here we go, Fabio Romano. Now, Fabio, it's a very hot day today, and it's, if it's an invitational gauntlet, that means that after this match there'll be more competitors to come out. Indeed. So Fabio has, in theory, got the shortest straw here. Are you, are, are you implying uh, something about his height? I was not doing that. If you're <laughs> going to say that, then I'm going to deflect it to you. I was never well, saying that. Uh, he's not going to win any um, fight oh. contests. Well That's done to Fabio right. holding on to the ropes. It looked like a monkey flip was attempted. And hang on. Oh, and face plants him. That could be it. It could be. Wow. Well, that was the first match down. First opponent. God, uh, see you later, pizza dude. Um, 
Is yeah. all I can really say. So that's his name, Pizza Dude. Right, gotcha. Ah, that's what I'm going with, Pizza Dude. So, I mean, Fabio Romano, to be fair, hasn't even taken his shirt off. Oh, he's asking for the next competitor. There we go. Let's see. Wait, he made short work of that. Oh, hang on. I recognise this so music. So do I. I recognise this from, from Maidstone. It's, it has a familiar sound to it. It does. And for those of you watching on YouTube, it's this has no doubt been copyright strikes. Oh, look who it is. Here we go. That's right, local Joe. competitor Joe. Joe. Just, just Joe. D yeah, well, local competitor Joe. So local competitor Joe. I mean, let's just clarify, Kieran, yeah, that he was also Joe. the local competitor in Maidstone. He's he the local was. competitor here in Chatham. It makes me wonder if when he says local... Very bizarre, that individual as well. I mean, he moves a lot. I think he must move house yeah. quite a lot. Yeah, I, I remember him being part of a, uh, a multi-person match in Maidstone where he kind of... He's, yeah, it was very strange to say the least. Well, all but joking aside though, local competitor Joe, phenomenal athlete, phenomenal wrestler, and actually, although we're talking to make it a bit of fun, actually, actually an incredible competitor. Absolutely. Well, oh, now he's taking the shirt off. Oh, that's why. And Romano just hammering away here on local competitor Joe. Joe there goes oh, the camera. Goodness, there goes the camera. But that shows you how much force was thrown into that post. And it's oh, wait a minute. Oh, and Romano almost defeated there by Joe. Oh, Feynman's carry. What's he going to do here? Romano, is he going to finish again? Oh, he's going for that manoeuvre again. Oh, the throat thrust. And then one to the chest and an uppercut. Good strike in this from Romano. What a clothesline from Fabio Romano. Oh, he's impact. taking his headband now. I mean, serious business. Oh, that's, that's not good. Oh, threw it right into the Chatham crowd. <laughs> that's, that's not good. On a foot across the throat. That's not oh, hang loud, on. surely. Lo it looked like local competitor was going for the foot there. But it is a hot day today. Again, there's only so much energy someone's got. It appears so. Oh, ducks underneath. Oh, beautiful net breaker. Huge spinning net breaker. Fantastic move. Kicked out of one. Fabio only with one. I was ready with the hammer. Again, heat and fatigue could be the story of the match here today. Front face lock reversed. Oh, here it is again. Oh, he's got him. Look at me, I'm ready with the bell. Oh. oh, wait! That was a two. Oh, now Fabio. Uh -oh. Hang on, what he's is Fabio Anaconda doing? Anaconda Vice. Uh -oh. Yes, he's got Anaconda Vice. Oh, he's going to make him submission. He wants, to, he wants to win by submission. That. Wow, impressive for Fabio go. Romano. That's two wins in a row. I mean, questionably, he already had local competitor Joe beaten uh, with that finishing manoeuvre of that uh, finished pizza guy. Um, <laughs> Absolutely, hang on. Oh, they're no longer opponents, it's victim now. Oh, hang on. Oh, whoa. Hold on a minute. What? Now, the look on Fabio's face implies that he knows who this is. I don't think this I know is, who this um, is. A definitely a change in facial expression. Yeah! Oh, wait a minute! Wow! Hang on, this is one of Fabio's friends. For those that don't know, when we tend to run UKPW shows, we have sort of an open-door policy with people to bring in their colleagues. And I was talking to this guy earlier. I didn't know he was going to be in the match. And I think Fabio brought him along. And could this be the final entrant in this Super Smash Brothers gauntlet? This would be surprising. Wow. 
Adriano. And uh, Fabio looks very confused. Yeah. As to why his friend is out here. saying we don't need to fight we've got a lot of history people even chat them they want to fight so it's on it's down to adriano to decide of course they want to fight yeah we're gonna get a handshake yeah maybe there it is okay yeah, fine yeah okay fine we're not gonna get one okay oh no oh, hang on i don't think that's the end of it Oh, but Adriano wants to be a friendly competition with his uh, buddy Fabio Romano. He's here to fight. Fabio, oh! Oh, hang on. The first way slot takedown, planting Romano down. And we and the, the bell is sounded. We are having, having a match here between friends. Well, let's just say Fabio has already had technically two matches already. Absolutely. Okay, there might have been quick ones, but he's still been out in this heat for, for that period of time. And now his good friend is having a battle that they were not pre like they were not prepared for. Ah, it, it seems so. Oh, nice reversal there from Fabio. The elbow manages to get free. See what they take down. Trying to turn him over, but Adriano shoves him away. But Romano with a side headlock. Romano off the ropes, far side. Oh, shoulder block sending Fabio Romano down. Wow. And Adriano. Oh, look at wow. that. The roll Very through good. as well. Into the front face lock. Oh, I don't know if he's going for a suplex or a falcon arrow, but Romano reverses. Three on another, there's him shoulder again. Sending Romano down to the canvas. Oh, look at that running European uppercut. And another one. Oh, beautiful flying European uppercut. Oh, two counts. Very good. Now, I'm quite impressed by this, Adriano. Absolutely. As I said, I was having a chat with him very briefly earlier. He was just here to soak in the British culture learn a little bit about British wrestling, but it turns out he was actually here to be a part of this Super Smash Brothers Invitational. And Fabio's saying, I've had enough of this. Yeah, I think Fabio's done, He's, but Adriano's saying no. You, you're you know? done, you're done. Okay, right, yeah, that's fine. Right, oh, no, hang Adriano. on, no. That's it, Adriano. Adriano, oh, no, hang on. Now, we're on the concrete again. There's no mat. Huge chop there. Yeah, there's no mats. Oh, my goodness. What a reply from Adriano. That, ladies and gentlemen, is what we call in wrestling a receipt. Absolutely. I mean, these guys are meant to be friends. Well, I think the uh, friendship and the lack of wanting some friendship competition on the part of Fabio Romano is... Uh, and I think KM Lane is trying to get these guys back to the ring. I think they are again, ladies and gentlemen. Our vision is impaired from where we are, but you can see it. Fabio running back. Fabio's back into the ring, out of break. Things for a moment. Can he get a breather? Hang on. Adriano's Referee. in the ring. Oh my goodness! Kicking the rope into the nether regions of Adriano. 
And what's oh my Romano goodness! Doing here? Suicide dive through there, but he caught him! Adriano caught him! Oh, it just rams him spine first into the ring apron. Oh my goodness, and there you go, just slams on the second hardest part of the ring. Oh, that was it. Oh, there we go, some high fives all round. Nice. Well, I think Adrian will be impressed at how well the uh, locals here in Chatham Kent have taken to him. Hang on, what is Fabio What's, doing? What is he doing? Interesting. No? Ooh, he's gone under the ring. Adriano, not sure where Fabio's got. There we go, the fans here are helping out, saying he's under the ring. Well, Romano, he's come out this side. Oh, no. That was smart for That was Romano. smart. That was very good. Oh, a face first into the ring post. The officially hardest part of the ring. Fabio having so much fun here at the dockyard. There we go. People want Adriano to do well here. Into a cover. cover. Oh, only a one. Barely a one. Again, Fabio on the offense, using the ropes. Yeah, the knee across the throat of Adriano. Big chop there from Fabio Romano. Oh, and another one. Now Adriano coming back with shots of his own, his forearms to the corner. Steve, oh, Romano moves out of the way, but he gets the elbow up. Keeps Romano at bay. Romano comes again, but he's yep. caught Adriano's legs. Oh, using the ropes. Oh, and a net breaker across the knee. Oh, so much whiplash. Wow. You gotta say, whether you like him or not, that was impressive from Fabio Romano. That was impressive. Oh, got the rope. KM Lane with the rope. Very good. Good ring awareness there. Oh, that was a huge clubbing blow. And another one. Fabio is not playing nice with his friend here. Another big shot there. Oh, he stabs on that on his hand. Oh, boot to the face. You can't, if you can't, can't beat him, just kick him. This is the mean streak we can't expect from Fabio Romano. This is what Alexander Rafael, champion yesterday, had to face, but still managed to pick up the victory. Lovely net breaker there by Romano. And again, can't pull his friend away. I was ready with the bell. I really thought that could have been over there. Interesting. Full head of steam. Adriano moves. Breaks it. Kick. What's Adriano got here? Underneath, forearm across the chest. Huge forearm. Back into that corner. Here he comes. Oh, that European uppercut again. Oh, Romano with a boot up. Excellent work. Up and around. Oh, gets him down into a big bad breaker. Wow. I think that really did some damage to both ends there. Oh, not surprised. Well, listen crowd to these people here. here. The crowd here in, at the historic dockyard in Chatham, Kent, firmly behind Adriano and letting him know about it. I don't know who, who's going to win this. It's close line. And another one. Fabio has been in two matches prior. Could the heat, could the fatigue really be coming into play now? Get another European uppercut into that corner. Rolls Fabio through. This is the clothesline. Shot to the midsection again. Another suplex, baby, oh. but he's Adriano he gets away in two. What a little falcon arrow, backbreaker almost. Oh, and somehow Romano just, just gets the shoulder up. This, the longer this match goes, the longer I do not know who's going to win. I have no idea. It is scorching here today at the Chatham Dockyard. I just don't know. Paul Nelson. Oh, He's got it locked in, I think. Into the corner. He's still got it locked in tight. That vice-like grip from Adriano. 
Oh, and a stump on the foot. Didn't Still it. Oh, there we oh, go. Oh, now he's broken it. Wait for that. Close oh, he's going back in again. And Romano again rolls him over. Oh, that was the three. Wow. <laughs> he's claiming he had a handful of the tights. I think, I think he may be right there. there. Wow, yeah, well that's done. questionable. Very good. Looks like UKPW management are going to uh, have a, a little bit of reviewing to do from today yeah, this weekend. Absolutely. Fabio there won three matches in a row. Phenomenal well, effort there from Adriano. Absolutely. Can we just take a moment to appreciate Adriano and his debut here at UKBW? Absolutely fantastic debut showing from Adriano. And we will see you our next match.